Here, let a kid do it. I got it. Wait, let me just take a picture. Yes, it's recording. Hello, everyone. Welcome. I would like to take this opportunity to make a bit of a confession. My name is Tony Victorino, and I am a Kim Possible fan. Yes, it's true, but I know it's nothing to be ashamed of, for there are other Kim Possible fans all over the world. You may even be surprised to know that there are Kim Possible fans around you each and every day that you are unaware of. Might even be somebody close that you know. But there are signs, things to look for, that may or may not be so obvious. So what I have done is compiled a list of what to look for to determine if someone just might be a Kim Possible fan that I have written down on these three by five cards I have here. For instance, if you know somebody who makes up a list on three by five cards, they just might be a Kim Possible fan. When your friend asks for a favor and they end with, please and thank you, they just might be a Kim Possible fan. For whatever reason, if somebody gives you the puppy dog pal, they just might be a Kim Possible fan. If you hear someone's cell phone with this ringtone, and the answer with, what's the cinch? They just might be a Kim Possible fan. If you see someone checking their hair dryer to make sure it's not loaded before they use it, they just might be a Kim Possible fan. Oh, and the same goes for lipstick as well. Whoa, 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 look at that. Oh, sorry, wrong lipstick. <laughs> sorry about that, folks. If you see someone driving a scooter, with a bubble horn, they just might be a Kim Possible fan. Ladies, if your boyfriend is easily distracted by red-headed women, <laughs> oh, I was looking at her, uh, hair. She reminded me of Kim Possible. Be not so quick to judge. He just might be a Kim Possible fan. Gentlemen, if your girlfriend gives you a belt as a gift for your half anniversary, even though you might not know what that is exactly, you might have a pants problem. And she just might be a Kim Possible fan. While at a pet store, if the salesperson tries to convince you that an angry gorilla would make a great children's pet, you hope that they are being sarcastic. And they just might be a Kim Possible fan. While at the zoo, if your tour guide tells you that the smartest animal in the world is a naked mole rat, More rat. They just might be a Kim Possible fan. While over at your best friend's house, if their mother makes you pancakes from scratch just because just because she's feeling retro, she just might be a Kim Possible fan. When inviting someone to a birthday party, if the response is, hold it right there, slick. I don't do cakes, okay? I don't bake them, and I don't jump out of them. They just might be a Kim Possible fan. If your spouse leaves you a note that reads, gone bowling with the henchmen, <laughs> they just might be a carry uh, they just might be a Kim Possible fan. Same goes for a karaoke with the management as well, just to let you know. Uh, 
Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> yes. If your spouse, while going through a midlife crisis, starts dressing up like a pirate, no need to worry. They might not need counseling after all. Or they just might be a impossible fan. While at the ticket counter at the airport, if you overhear the person next to you asking to purchase an airline ticket just by using their frequent favor miles, they just might be a impossible fan. Now, if you're going down at the San Diego Comic Con, and if someone ever introduces themselves while using a dramatic, a dramatic no. villain light, ah, no. I'm Lord Victorino. Ah, they just might be a Kim Possible fan. <coughs> while at a fancy restaurant. If you see an adult whipping out a coupon book and then asking to see the kids' menu, they just might be a impossible fan. <laughs> if you see someone walking down the sidewalk and for no apparent reason they yell, I hate meat cakes, but you're not sure why, they just might be a impossible fan. If you know someone who won't eat at fast food restaurants, Unless they serve their drinks with bendy straws, they just might be a Kim Possible fan. While, while you're at an all-you-can-eat buffet, if you see someone covering everything on their plate with nacho cheese, or dipping everything on their plate in hummus, they just might be a Kim Possible fan. Now, while playing the board game Scrabble, if your opponent ever gets a triple word score for the word Neutronalizer, they just might be a impossible fan. When taking your car in for repair, if the auto repair mechanic refers to you as a car monkey, wait, before you deck them, think about it. They just might be a impossible fan. If your business partner refuses to sign any contract, unless it also includes a no cloning clause, they just might be a impossible fan. If your boss has a sign hanging on the wall of their office that reads, I hate Tuesdays, they just might be a impossible fan. While in an elevator, if you overhear two gentlemen discussing ideas for a new season of the greatest hit cartoon TV series ever, they just might be the Kim Possible creators Bob Schooley and Mark McCarkle. Well, we can only hope. If your loving mother fixes you a bacon and egg breakfast in the form of a happy face, and then for dinner, Meatloaf in the form of a human brain. <laughs> no need to panic. She might not be going mad after all. She just might be a impossible fan. If any of you here today enjoyed the reading of my list, you too are indeed a impossible fan. You've been a great audience. Please thank you. Yay. 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 Yay.